Hey everyone, Scott here from Simple Mechanic Advice. Today we will talk about how to release the parking brake. Here's how to do it. 1. Using tools. If you're having trouble with a stuck parking brake lever, you can use different tools to release the parking brake. To do this, place a flathead screwdriver into the notch near the base of the parking brake lever and gently lift it to release the brake. Gently tap the base of the parking brake lever with a hammer to help loosen it. Be careful when using these tools as improper use can damage the brake lever or surrounding components. Only apply gentle pressure and avoid excessive force. Attach a vice grip to the parking brake cable and pull it towards the front of the vehicle to release the brake. When using a vice grip on the cable, be gentle to avoid damaging the cable, which could lead to more costly repairs. 2. Releasing a GM electronic parking brake. For vehicles equipped with a GM electronic parking brake, you can manually release it by following these steps. 1. Wear your seatbelt and turn the ignition to the on-run position, but don't start the engine. Some systems require the ignition to be on to release the brake. 2. For all automatic vehicles, set the transmission to park. Set the transmission to neutral for manual ones. This helps ensure the vehicle remains stationary while you work. 3. Press and hold the brake pedal to keep pressure on the system. Keeping your foot on the pedal prevents the car from moving or rolling unexpectedly. 4. Locate the EPB switch on the center console and press the button to disengage the brake. In some older models, you may need to pull up the lever simultaneously. Check your owner's manual for your specific model's instructions. 5. For a foot-operated parking brake located under the steering column, Push the pedal with your foot to release it. 6. After the brake is disengaged, shift into gear and start driving. 7. By following these steps, you'll be good to go, but remember to reapply the parking brake when you park at your destination. 3. Using rear brake calipers for electromechanical parking brakes. Another method is to get under the vehicle to release the brake manually. To do this, Carefully lift the vehicle with a jack and stabilize it using jack stands. Locate the rear brake calipers under the vehicle and remove the bolts from the electromechanical parking brake motor. This procedure may not work for a vehicle with no bolts. This method is only applicable for certain vehicles with electromechanical parking brakes that have accessible bolts. If you're unsure, consult your owner's manual or a professional mechanic. Attempting this without proper knowledge could lead to significant damage to the brake system. Use the appropriate socket to turn the caliper piston adjustment bolt and disengage the brake. Incorrectly adjusting the caliper piston can damage the brake mechanism. If you're unfamiliar with this process, it is recommended to seek professional help. After the brake is released, lower the vehicle. You should be able to move the vehicle as needed. Thanks for watching.